let's solve problem number two Angelica and Camille are partners with capital balances on January 1, 2012 of 40,000 and 50,000 respectively. The partnership agreement provided that each partner be allowed 10% interest on beginning capital balances. Angelica is to, re is to receive a salary allowances of 12,000 per annum, 20% bonus of income after interest salaries and bonus and the balance equally how much is the share of each partner if net income for the year is 105,000 so distribution of income na naman so let's create three columns one column for Angelica then column for Camille then total then first line item is salary allowance ni Angelica Angelica nga ba? Angelica 12,000 so 12,000 kay Camille 0 so total is 12,000 then next item na given is Interest, 10% on beginning capital balances. Interest on beginning capital balances. Kay Angelica ay 40. Kay Camila ay 50 times 10%. For, so, 40,000 times 10%. Kay Angelica. Kay Camille, 50,000 times 10% kula na zero. Ayan. So, a total of 9,000 si interest. And then, bonus. Yeah, bonus. Bonus. Then, remainder. Ayan. So, tandaan natin na itong bonus ay bibigay lamang kapag profit lang si partnership remainder is equally okay tapos 105 daw ang total profit na i-allocate so dapat lahat ng to 105 ang maging total bonus is 20% 20% Find B. So, dalawa na wala bonus at remainder. Pero, kailangan muna nating hanapin ang bonus bago natin may squeeze ang remainder. So, sa pagkuha ng bonus, guys, ito lang ang formula na dapat tandaan. Bonus is equals to rate multiply by base. So, rate is 20%. Base is nasa problem 20% of bonus of income income after interest and salaries and bonus so if i-translate natin siya income less salary less interest less bonus 20% daw nito lagyan natin ang parenthesis and then, i-replace natin yung mga items na given sa problem. Income is 105. Ito. And then, salary is 12,000. Interest is 9,000. Then, minus bonus. Yan. I-replace na natin yung bonus ng B lang, letter B lang para hindi mahirap ayan okay so from here subtract na natin si 105,000 less 12,000 less 9,000 
84,000 hanggang sa umikli na na umikli yung ating ang tawag dyan yan okay i-multiply natin ng 20% 84,000 times 20% diba 20% times 84,000 minus B So, 20% times 84,000 16,800 So, this one is 16,800 Minus 20% times B Negative B So, negative siya ito kasi may imaginary na 1, di ba? Na 1 yung B. So, 1 times 0.20%. 0.2. So, 0.2B. Negative 0.2B. So, after nyan, sa, di ba sa algebra, ang, par ang same sign is pagsasamahin kasi papaikli natin to hanggang sa B na lang ang matira so same sign so B B sa left may point 0.2 B sa right itong B sa left may imaginary na 1 diba and then so kung ililipat natin itong point to negative point two sa kabila para makapiling si 1B from negative magiging positive siya kasi ganun ang rules algebra so magiging 1.2B na siya 1.2B then after this kailangan makancel yung 1.2 yung 1.2B na yan may imaginary denominator na 1 para ma-cancel, kailangan natin siyang i-multiply sa 1 over 1.2. So, kung ano ang gagawin natin sa left side, ganun din ang gagawin sa right side. So, si 16.8, i-multiply din natin ng 1 over 1.2. And then, pag na-multiply na siya, maka-cancel na yung 1.2 Diba? So, B na lang siya sa left side If 16.8 times 1 over 1.2 is E di 16 Over 1.2 Matidivide mo na siya Ayan, so 16.8 Divided by 1.2 is 14,000 So, B is ang bonus is 14,000 Machi-check natin siya gamit yung formula natin na bonus is equals to rate times base so ito lang din yan i-replace natin yung B ng kung magkano compute natin na 14,000 so 105 minus 12 minus 9 minus 14 70,000 70,000 70 So 20% ng 70,000 is 70,000 times 0.20 point 14,000 Yun balance so tama ang 14,000 na nakompute natin as bonus meron na tayong bonus for Angelica na 14,000 makukuha na natin yung remainder may squeeze na natin so 105 minus salary na 12 minus interest na 9 minus bonus na 14 70 ang 
So, 70 ang remainder. Sabi sa problem, remainder or balance should will be shared equally. So, for Angelica, half of 70,000. Same with Camille, half of 70,000. So, tig 35 sa remainder. Alt equals. To sum this, yung para kay Angelica, press natin yung alt equals. Yan, magsasum siya. So, highlight lang natin. So, Angelica and Camille, 105,000. Same with 105,000. So, balance eh. How much share of each partner if net income for the year is 105? Of each partner. So, Angelica, ang profit or income allocation niya ay 65,000. Kay Camila ay 40,000. So, that is the answer for problem number 2. Gawa natin ng journal entry. Kung yung journal entry natin siya, di ba ang salary, interest, and bonus ay allocation lang ng profit, hindi siya treated as expense. So, kung income siya, i-close natin yung income summary. So, paano natin i-close debit income summary? I-close natin sa capital account ng mga partners. 105 debit. Credit Angelica Capital. Angelica Capital. And then, Camille. Camille Capital. I-indent natin. Yan. 65 for Angelica, 40 kay Camille. So, that's it for problem number 2. Thank you.